这是羌极鱼，一种大型的海底觅食鱼类。它应该在几千万年前就灭绝了，但是它存活了下来。These are two whole coelacanths in our preserved in alcohol.、Um, before 1938, it wasn't thought this was possible because we only knew them from fossils. Here are two、um, whole examples. 还有更多的羌极鱼存活在世上。虽然他们曾经被认为在三亿五千万年前就消失了。目前一项有计划执行的科研任务。就是到印度洋中的塞舌尔群岛附近的深海中，寻找更多的羌极鱼。研究人员们希望在深海中的搜寻，能够发现他们想要的大惊奇。There's been almost no work on the deep waters around the Seychelles.、Um, so what's actually living there,、uh, we don't know yet.、Um, and the intention is to find that out. 那里有深海珊瑚，而研究人员们希望。为这一片空旷的海底世界绘制出地图。What we're doing, which is rather unique, is combining the 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 combination of of ROVs with submersibles and all these different research tools, so we can get a multidisciplinary understanding of how the ocean is changing. We've also pioneered, we've also developed a whole suite of new technologies as well around the camera systems in particular, and that's going to enable us to gather new 3D maps of the marine ecosystems that we discover. 研究人员说，了解海洋的变化并不仅仅是一项学术活动，它可能是一项生存或死亡的任务。There's real urgency to what we're doing because the ocean is changing faster than it has done for millions and millions of years. We need to understand how it's changing. We need to understand that now. The ocean is hitting a series of different tipping points, which if we if we if that happens, it's going to destroy its resilience to support life as we know on our planet. 尼克顿深海研究所已经在三月初起航去执行这项任务。谢谢您的收看，我们下期节目再会。